multiple myeloma still remains an incurable uh, cancer of the plasma cells. We have had a lot of new therapies that came up over the past few years. So patients are living a lot longer. But what we really don't have are drugs which are specifically targeted against the underlying biology. Now one of the things we have known over the years is the BCL2 family proteins. Uh, these are proteins which allow the cells to stay alive despite the normal um, stimuli that would make them die. And uh, the ability to uh, inhibit some of these proteins um, have become more available now with the introduction of new drugs. So venetoclax is a drug that is designed to specifically inhibit the BCL2 protein uh, in the cancer cells and it's being studied in a wide variety of different cancers. In myeloma we know that the expression or the amount of BCL2 protein in the myeloma cells is uh, really um, uh, is high and it also contributes to the cells being able to stay alive despite uh, numerous therapies that we throw at these myeloma cells. Um, so what has been done in the preclinical studies is looking at venetoclax uh, in, in the myeloma cells in the lab. It clearly shows that the, the venetoclax is able to kill these myeloma cells. And there, were, there have been data in the lab which shows that there are specific subgroups of patients from, whose cells are much more sensitive uh, to the venetoclax therapy. And that forms the background for the clinical investigations that have been done.